When a dog growls, like the rest of its vocalizations or its body language it is a means of communication. A means of communication that can give us a lot of information. It gives us information about your mood or how you feel in a certain situation. It is important not to qualify it as something good or something bad. It is simply a means of communication that will allow us to understand each other better. The most common is that we associate a canine grunt with aggressive behavior. This is not always the case. The dog can growl in different circumstances and situations. Many times with different meanings. 1. Grumbling game or happiness. Most dogs growl when they play, with other dogs or with us. Also in happy moments like when we got home or are waiting for something that they like. It is a grunt that we can recognize for the rest of your body language, if your attitude is relaxed and cheerful, if it shows postures of invitation to the game. It simply tells us that he is having a good time or that he is very excited or anxious to receive a prize or something he wants. 2. Grunting of pleasure. Many dogs growl when you are caressing them, massaging or scratching in areas that produce pleasure. Likewise, the rest of your body language will indicate that this growling is harmless, since you will be relaxed in loving attitude, or play, and without tension. 3. Grunting or snoring breathing. Some breeds grunt simply to get a little excited, especially the dogs that have the shortest snout, like the French Bulldog, the Boxer, etc. It is easier to produce sounds similar to grunting in many more situations than usual. Many dogs also snore when they sleep, or they can growl or cry if they are dreaming. 4. Warning grunts. In the warning growl the dog is telling us that he feels very uncomfortable in a situation. If it is towards us it tells us to stop what we are doing. It is the equivalent of a leave me alone, please. If the situation continues it may be that the next behavior is a blow of teeth or a bite. This would be the equivalent of giving a push in humans. We can clearly distinguish it from the other grunts because it is usually accompanied by body tension. The dog may show the teeth and signs of calm may appear, such as the signal to turn the head or lower it. If the dog is tense, grunts, bears its teeth and stares, it is a very powerful signal of for now or I do not respond to my actions. If we continue with what we are doing, the easiest thing is for a bite to follow. It is not good to make jokes, or play with these situations. First because the dog is having a bad time, and second because we expose ourselves to a bite. Normally before a warning growl appears, the dog will show a large number of signals. These so-called appeasement and calm signals are prior warnings. Would you like to have more information, videos, consultations and free help for your dog every day? Visit the website that is located here below. Do not forget to subscribe to the channel, comment, and share the video. You are very well. Thank you.